Proverbs 17.24 says this, A discerning man keeps wisdom in view, but a fool's eyes wander to the ends of the earth. Now listen, I am a local pastor and a foreign missionary. I'm someone who is fully persuaded and convinced that God is calling us in accordance with Matthew chapter 28 and in a whole host of number of instructions in the Bible to share the gospel as close to us as possible and then all the way to the ends of the earth. I want you to take note today. I was, uh, I'm, I was preparing for a little Bible study I'm doing about the disciples. And I took a look at something William Barclay had written about Andrew. Listen to what he says. Andrew began by introducing his brother Peter to Jesus. That's found in John chapter 1, verse 40 uh, through 42. For Andrew, missionary work began at home. It still often happens that he who is looking for something to do for Jesus Christ will find it in his own home. Listen, missionary work starts at home. Andrew brought his brother Peter before Jesus, and then Peter became the lead disciple. I want to encourage you today this way. Don't only think about mission work as some far-off thing to do, some far-off place to go. No. Missionary work is the work of sharing Jesus wherever you are. The thing that gives me great joy when we take people to Haiti, which we take a ton of people to Haiti, so much so that now other people that we've taken are taking people to Haiti. What a beautiful thing. The thing that gives me so much joy is when folks have their eyes opened up to this fact. While in Haiti, they're sharing the gospel. It's a beautiful thing. Then they come home and they realize, wait a minute, I can share the gospel here too. Listen, God is calling us to begin our missionary work at home. Be a light and an example of Jesus Christ wherever we are. Lead our own brother to Jesus. And then wherever God calls us, wherever he sends us, share the gospel First, by way of being a living reflection of kingdom principles, bearing spiritual fruit in public. And then secondly, by telling others, hey, this is what Jesus did for me, and he can do the same thing for you. Listen, God bless you today. Start at home, and then go wherever God calls you and leads you. Amen.